Hey, what's going on guys? So today we're going to be taking a look at um, the T-Mobile network as you cross from Nevada, like uh, the uh, Reno area into California on uh, uh, Highway 395. And uh, this is their low band 5G network. Uh, and I think we were going like about 70 miles per hour. Um, so it's performing quite well for the speed we're traveling, of course. Um, and as you can see, upload is performing very well, peaking up uh, at about 91 down, or 91 up, my bad. Um, but then it dropped down a bit as we passed by a hill. Um, but overall, really good performer there in uh, that little uh, suburban area. And uh, as I transition here into the next test, uh, you'll see in a second, I actually passed into California and Google Maps will let me know as soon as uh, we cross the border here. So i um, kind of kind of interesting so you see uh, we crossed into California and uh, performance is uh, pretty good besides being uh, behind that hill um, so at this point it's shooting down not only through through that little valley but uh, it, it was just kind of a weird shape there of like the terrain and stuff so kind of odd Now we're going to go over a uh, test that I did the day prior to this um, uh, that was on Highway 95 on the way to Reno, uh, really out in the middle of nowhere. Um, literally, there was nothing out there, nothing nearby. I, I don't even remember the town that we had gone through. It, it was empty. Um, so it's basically just a tower that's meant for people driving by. And um, I was actually quite surprised by... Uh, the performance, um, because up until that point, we had been seeing, uh, you know, under 10 megabits per second down, and um, there was a lot of roaming that we did, and a couple times it would switch to sprint. So, um, yeah, it, it was a welcomed, welcomed performance increase. Upload, obviously, not so great, but that could really be down to the backhaul on that tower. Um, but as you can see here, as I'm showing, I think we were going. <laughs> Uh, 70, 75, and uh, out there in the desert, and it was performing quite well. Uh, ping times, 22 millisecond ping, 3 millisecond jitter, and about the same performance, uh, just a little farther down the road there from that first test. And uh, looks like it peaked over 5 megabits per second for the upload, which is totally usable. Um, you know, I'm not trying to upload anything ma major, so... Yeah, so real simple test for today. Uh, that was just uh, as I was traveling across the desert, their, uh, their network performance. So yeah, thanks for watching and uh, hope you have a great rest of your day.